I'm Justin Martin with Duck Commander, and this is Duck Dog University. Hey, I'm Sean Sims with Waterfowl Widowmakers. I think to be a good dog trainer, it's just like anything else. You have to pay attention to detail. It's the same way we're building duck calls. If you don't pay attention to detail, you're just gonna put out a middle of the road product and, and dogs are no different. Sean really pays attention to detail. He takes the time to learn the dogs. His Waterfowl Widowmakers kennel, great service. What I really enjoy about it is the fact that he is hands on with every dog. He doesn't take so many dogs where he's got bird boys and everything else running them. He is working hands on with your dog every day. And that, that really means a lot to me. I got started in training dogs many years ago. A friend of mine talked me into going duck hunting with him and we were hunting in little beaver ponds and stuff and uh, we couldn't get to the duck so I was raised that you need to retrieve all the game you get so after the end of that season I asked my wife if I could get a retriever. Uh, a couple of months later she bought me a little lab pup. Uh, I trained it the best of my ability but once I realized what these dogs were capable of and the bond you're uh, between man and dog, it's pretty unbelievable what you're able to teach them. Every day they amaze me what they're capable of. Sean Sims of Waterfowl Widowmakers here to help you pick out a puppy. Where I would start is call your local trainers. They're familiar with all the dogs in the area and they can help point you in the right direction. If you are looking online, be sure to check with the references and make sure the particular breeder has what you are looking for. The next thing we want to look at is pedigree and genetics. The pedigree proves that the parents were trainable, et cetera. Genetics, we want to be sure the dog is genetically clear of any health defects. Do that by making sure the parents have all their health clearances. The last thing I look for in picking out a puppy is a breeder that has expose the dogs to gunfire, water, uh, and properly socialize them. The more this gets done with these puppies at a young age, the better off you are. All right, I was I ask all the time, how do I pick my puppies? Well, I may be a little bit different than the average person because I want the wildest uh, retrieve crazy puppy out of the bunch. But, so I'm looking for a, a good duck dog. With that being said, I do most of that by picking a good breeding. Now, once I make it to, to check out the litter, yes, I want them retrieving, but the main thing is I'm gonna let the puppy pick me. So I'm just gonna kind of move around in the kennel, which they're all coming to me right now, but there'll be one that's in front, like this one with the little yellow collar. Let's see where it was the first one to me. Well, she got sidetracked with the big dog. So I'm just gonna kinda see which puppy attaches itself to me and then we'll go from there. Uh, the next step is uh, none of these puppies have ever seen a bumper. I'm just gonna kinda see what they'll do with it. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. The main thing is when you're picking out a puppy, pick out the puppy with the personality that you want. I want the wild and crazy duck dog. A lot of people don't want one with quite as much drive as I do, so you're gonna want one in the, in the middle of the pack. If you're looking for a pet, the one that's sitting over in the corner, that may be the perfect puppy for you. So just pick the puppy that has the best personality for you. All right, we're gonna to talk to you a little bit today about how to pick your trainer for your new pup. You got several options. Where I would start is go to my local hunting retriever club. AKC and UKC both have those. Um, if you don't have time to go to their training days or any of their competitions, get online. Most of them have a website. You can call the secretary or president and they can give you a list of all your local pros. Uh, another good place to look would be your veterinarian. They know what, they know any local trainers in the area. They know if, uh, if the dogs are well behaved and that sort of stuff when they come in, it'll give you a good place to start. Once you've narrowed down your list of trainers, I would highly recommend going and spending a day training with them. See if that, dog, that trainer's style is what you're looking for. Every trainer has their own little unique style. Just train with them. You'll, you'll figure out which trainer has the, the personality you're looking for.